sun powers everything we do on Earth. It's bright, it's massive, but in a cosmic galaxy with hundreds of billions of stars, our sun doesn't look particularly special. In fact, you could probably call our sun average. Average size, average brightness, a simply average star. But here's the truth. Being average might be exactly what makes it extraordinary. Our sun is huge about 864,000 miles across, and it holds over 99% of all the mass in our solar system. That's every planet, moon, asteroid, and comet combined, all orbiting around this one blazing sphere of plasma. But out there amongst its fellow stars, it's pretty normal. Scientists classify stars by size, color, and temperature, and our sun sits right in the middle of that chart. It's what's called a G-type main sequence star, or simply a yellow dwarf star. These yellow dwarf stars make up about 7.5% of the Milky Way stars, common enough to not stand out and rare enough to be just a bit special. They burn hydrogen in their cores, just like the sun does, shining steadily for billions of years. If the sun were much larger, it would burn out faster. It's radiation too intense for life to survive. If it were much smaller, Earth would be just a frozen wasteland, but the sun? just right. Stable energy, perfect warmth, and a lifespan long enough for complex life to evolve on a tiny blue planet. It's the ultimate Goldilocks star. Not too big, not too small, just right for life. When you look beyond our solar system, you see just how wild the universe gets. There are neutron stars that pack the mass of the sun into a city-sized sphere. White dwarfs, the burnt out remnants of once powerful suns and blue giants that blaze hotter than any furnace we can imagine. In a universe full of extremes, chaos, explosion, and collapse, our sun stands out for its stability. It's not the biggest, the brightest, or the most powerful, but it's exactly what we needed.